Coming up in this tutorial, I'm gonna be showing you how to create the perfect picnic camper that you can use for celebrating with your friends and family or give as a gift to somebody this spring summer. So keep watching to find out how we do it. and welcome back to All About Aoife. So today I thought I'd do something a bit different. I'm in the garden because we're finally getting a tiny bit of nice weather and I'm gonna take advantage of it because why not? We don't get the best weather here in Ireland and summer is coming up so it can be the time of the year when you can have some lovely picnics. So today I thought I'd show you how to make the perfect picnic hamper. So I've started it here behind me and of course you could give this as a gift to somebody or you could just make it for yourself and have the perfect picnic with you and your friends or your family. So I'm going to start off with the main item for a picnic blanket for a picnic I should say which is of course a picnic blanket so I love this one because it's really great the way it folds up it actually has a little bit of velcro here so that means it is great for storing away in the car it also has a kind of like a foil underside so that you don't get any wet coming through the blanket which is great because sometimes especially in Ireland the, the grass can be a bit damp so I'm gonna pop this down on the ground because I don't want to get any dampness on my clothes at the moment so I'm just gonna pop this lovely big picnic blanket down to get a nice feel and I'm gonna pop myself on it. I'm gonna bring over my big picnic hamper here and this is just a few bits that I got and I'm gonna talk you through them now. So the first one I suppose another important item for a picnic is a cooler bag because you're probably gonna be bringing some drinks and some cold items. So this cooler bag is actually from Penny's and I thought it was really great because again, it's good for traveling. It folds away really nicely and it folds out nicely too. It has this really funky pattern and of course it has the kind of metallic cooling on the inside and then it has gold on top which I thought that was really funky and cool I loved the little design and as well it doubles as kind of like a little backpack or a little hold all uh, handbag so you know what you can be fashionable while you're carrying around your picnic items which I thought was really cool I got of course these little mason jar jam jar glasses which I thought were really cute they're great I suppose there's something a little bit different and they're all trending at the moment now you see a lot of these online and I thought the little yellow caps and you get the straw included as well were just really cute and fresh and summery and then I got two other little funkier ones which are almost like a little light bulb shape which I thought were really cute so I thought these could be for the kids and something a little bit different something that you wouldn't see every day so I thought they were great I got this gorgeous little candle which is like a little mini mason jar again with a yellow gingham lid but this is like a little citronella candle so great for keeping away all the bugs while you're trying to eat your picnic so I thought this was really cute and I think this is only like 99 cents or something really cheap and it matches in with all of my other stuff which is great so next up in my picnic hamper is some plates. So I have some plastic plates here. These are really springy and cute and these are great for the adults. And then I have some paper plates for the kids because you know, the kids don't really care. So I got these cool metallic paper plates. So of course you gotta have plates. And then with the plates, you have to have some cutlery to eat your picnic. And I picked up these really cute little party porcelain uh, cutlery set. So they're kind of like this little wooden and then they have like a china kind of porcelain little design down below which I thought was really something different and something I haven't seen before and yeah you get six spoons six forks and six knives so great for your picnic another item that I picked up was these lovely little napkins so these are my yellow and white spotted napkins and they're gonna go great with my little jam jar glasses and yeah I got this little napkin holder as well so this is going to keep down your napkins and stop them from flying all over the place because when a gust of wind comes along you don't want to be grabbing everything so this is a great little uh, weight of course if you can't get your hands on anything like this you could kind of bring something similar as a paper weight to weigh down your napkins Next up, keeping with the yellow and white theme, I have these lovely little polka dot uh, treat boxes. So these are great if you're handing out 
kind of a sharing bag of popcorn or crisps or even sweets and you want everybody to have their own these are great for uh, dishing out bigger bags of stuff and yeah I thought they were really cute as well you get about eight in this so great for the picnic and they match in with everything else which is great I love matching items I also picked up these really cute little flamingo straws I thought they were great and really funky and fun for the kids and you can, of course make a little kind of punch to bring with you and have a little cocktail at your picnic why not and these are really funky as well and then to put your cocktail in or whatever drink you you're going to get I found this little fold away um, container that you can just fill up with whatever drink you're having it holds 3.3 liters which is great so that it just extends and then you can fold it away so nice and handy for traveling and then the kids can just help themselves to whatever the drink is at the time I've got a couple more things left in my picnic hamper one is these really cute little jelly molds so you give four little molds here so you can make the jelly before you go and then they have a little top on them as well so they're really great for transporting we give them to the kids and everybody is happy out so these are really cute plastic so they won't break great again for the picnic and the last item in my picnic hamper is these really cute little boards so these go with my little cutlery set down here with the china print on them Three little cheese boards they say of course you could pop your sandwiches on these or whatever you're bringing to your picnic so yeah these are great because they're disposable as well so you can just throw them away after and you don't have to worry about any cleaning up so these are really cute as well and I love the china print on them so that is the last item in my picnic hamper I think this is the perfect picnic hamper and it would be a great gift I'd love to receive this and I'm definitely going to be planning some picnics now for the near future so if you guys have enjoyed watching this picnic hamper tutorial today then make sure to give me a big thumbs up don't forget to comment below if you've liked this video and of course subscribe to all ready if you haven't already and i hope you have an enjoyable picnic if you choose to go out and use some of these fabulous items in my picnic hamper today thanks for watching guys